back to work or what? It was uh, definitely back to work the next day. I mean, um, <clears throat> after the game, there was a lot of celebration going on. Everybody happy in the locker room. But I think uh, the whole team as a whole understand the focus that it's, it's never over. And um, <clears throat> even when the clock is zero and a new week start, <laughs> It's a whole nother preparation, and, and uh, you can't sleep on no team. So I think um, I think we understood that. And coming in on Sunday, you know, you change your whole. You go from a, from a it's an emotional high, and then it just totally changes to scrape preparation and focus. And you got to go into there uh, and be prepared for the next game. Because I think they're a pretty good team. How important it is it? You think? I mean, you you got the first. You're assured now of at least the first non-losing season. How important it is it to make that the first winning season period? It's um, it's more than important. It's, it's 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 almost everything. I mean, um, you don't just settle for um, you don't settle for less. You always drive for more, and strive for success. And I think we understand that <clears throat> that um, it's not over yet. The season's not over, and even even after this game, it um, it still won't be over. I mean, every game you approach like it's your last, and you go out there and, and prepare to to play a great team. And um, if you don't do that and put the necessary preparation in on Saturday, it'll show up. Talk about Middle Tennessee. Um, how elusive is Dwight Dasher? How do you how do you plan to stop a player like that? Um, one person. I don't think one person can stop a player like that. I think it takes a whole team. And um, a concept we uh, approach is uh, un cerebro. Um, that's the whole team. That's one brain. I think it's one function, and it's going to take everybody on uh, to get the play call to um, to echo it, and um, everybody to swarm to the ball, eleven men to the ball at a time. And um, I think if we do that, play fast, and um, uh, Simon focused football, I think we'll be all right. I think we'll be great. Talk about your, your ride as a senior, just everything you've been going through this year, your ups and downs. Um, it's been some ups and downs. It's been some hard times. Um, uh, you know, first four games was tough. Um, played some uh, tough teams. Uh, we went out there and um, we, had, uh, we we faced some tough losses. Um, so, I mean, I think. Uh, Right, it's been it's been uh, it has a rough time on the roller coaster, but um, roller coasters also go up and down. So you know what I mean, it's been some good times too. Um, off the field, football, class, and everything has been going pretty uh, good, and um, I just hope that um, it continues that way. It seems like it's been like it was like, like I said, it was like a big change, but just something started clicking after that FAU game. Kind of like what anything you guys see happening there, or what? I think that's I think that's when we realize a lot of our players realize that um it's serious and um and you can't let this season slip away from you. And um we tightened up and uh, and um went back to focus and understanding that um that we have to go and um prepare for every team. It was a rival game. Um I think we understood that after that game we have to win out. We there's no other choice, like if we and um I think we prepare like that and I think um the team made a dedication to themselves out of that game that if we're going to do it, we have to do it now. I think, um, I think you got, I know you guys are focused on Middle Tennessee, but one of those bowl officials will be at this game watching to see what kind of a show you guys put. Is there any way you can make a little pitch to, to the fans to actually come out and support and show that this team can bring a, a, a big fan to face to, to a bowl game? Uh, yeah, I think, uh, I think we're very popular in the community. I think we're very popular around the school. Um, um, we, uh, a lot of football players, uh, we talk to the students and the people we see around. Uh, we wear a lot of FIU gear, um, try to talk to some of our uh, schoolmates or people in the community, tell them to come out and support us. Um, we go out there and we play hard, and I think when we play hard and we play fast, we do put on the show. 